I'm John Norris. This is MTV News. Guns N' Roses will kick off a U.S. tour on May 24th at Alpine Valley Music Theater in East Troy, Wisconsin. And tickets for that opening date go on sale this Saturday, February 9th, at Alpine Valley and area Ticketron outlets. No further dates have been announced yet, but we will, of course, keep you posted. GNR's long-awaited new album, Use Your Illusion, should be in stores about a month before that tour kicks off. You can watch for a preview of the GNR tour in the coming week here on MTV during our exclusive reports on the Rock and Rio 2 festival, where guns were among the headliners. Meantime, in other guns news, frontman Axl Rose and his wife Erin Everly have apparently ended their nine-month-long marriage by annulling it. Next week's Rolling Stone magazine will carry purported excerpts from the annulment papers in which Axel says that even before their wedding last April, his and Aaron's relationship was characterized by, quote, severe property damage, mutual acts of violence, and humiliation. And that while Axel considered Aaron his greatest inspiration, she made it quite clear she, quote, had no intention of complying with her promise to raise a family and be involved in a well-adjusted marital situation. There's no comment from GNR spokespeople. In the meantime, when the Anthrax Iron Maiden Tour plays the Palace of Auburn Hills outside Detroit on Monday, Anthrax will have a special guest in the audience. He's Greg Maston from nearby Warren, Michigan, who won an Eagle Scout Award last fall for creating a program to collect food, clothes, and toiletries for the homeless in his hometown. Maston said he was inspired by Anthrax's Who Cares Wins video, which pr protests the plight of the homeless in America. Anthrax couldn't make it to Maston's Eagle Scout ceremony back in October, but they did send a video greeting. On Monday, Anthrax will take Maston out to dinner before the show and present him with a specially customized bass guitar made of parts salvaged from a fire which swept through Anthrax's rehearsal studio in Yonkers, New York last summer while the band was recording its latest album, Persistence of Time. And that'll do it for the news. We'll have more later right here on MTV.